up the school, DJ Super Mike. And I'm here with the diamonds in the dirt. Recap. People don't understand what goes into a film like this. Baton Rouge is like home to some of the biggest artists in the world right now. They say if you can make it in New York, you can make it anywhere. It's bullshit. If you can make it here, you definitely can make it anywhere. We done been through some shit. So nigga, you remember? Like, yeah. I can just vividly remember putting a needle on that record and just hitting that record. A full night, Nero. Young and old get stupid behind that song. If you play, got a lot of respect. The whole club gone jump. The old West Coast movement affected Baton Rouge like no other coast. I was like, man, we could do the same thing, you know what I'm saying? I knew if I hit big, it was gonna be big. The first artist that really impacted Baton Rouge was Lowe. That nigga was putting on for us. What we normally have is street groups that are just organized around music or a label. Kids were being laid on our street. It was music driven. Louisiana has the highest incarceration rate in the world. This is what they're being taught. This is what they're being told. This is what they're being showed. And this is what they do. That was the birth of the camp. That's how the camp started. Like I ain't New York and I ain't California, but it's kind of its own thing down here. People thought you was crazy if you said, man, I'm gonna be a rapper, I'm gonna do music. Being able to dream is being able to have a vision that everybody else can't see. He had something special, man, and I knew he was gonna be something huge. I always had a husband's ambition. I always thought bigger than a lot of people. I always wanted more. I knew if I could just get him away from the streets, I had an income without the streets.